My mom would tell me what she's going to do to me. I'm going to beat the snot out of you. You hear me? I'm going to beat the snot out of you. I'm going to hit your head so hard, snot flies out of the front of your skull. It's going to be awesome. Oh, she was detailed. I'm going to spin your head off like a lid on a pickle jar. I'm going to take my leather belt with my name on it. I'm going to beat you and brand you at the same time. I'm like, Mom, you're the worst mummy in the world. No, I took second last year. I'm going for first this year. Sometimes my wife gets mad at me for behaving wrong in her dreams. That ain't fair. I had a horrible dream last night. You want to hear about it? No, I'm going to tell you anyway. A grizzly bear was chasing me through the woods with his teeth. He was going to eat me. And you did nothing. You just sat there and you didn't do a thing. What was I doing? You were playing poker with a rabbit. That's what you were doing. And that's the thing. You would do something like that. You would play poker with a rabbit. Well, I was being eaten by a bear. Luckily, a giant unicorn came and saved me with his laser horn. That's how I got saved, not by you. Like, I don't know what gallivanting means. Didn't want me doing that. Don't you go gallivanting around. Okay. You gallivant and I told you not to do this. But I just got blessed with a good wife. Not every guy has a good wife. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, think about Job in the Old Testament. Think about Job's wife. She must have been a real piece of work. I mean, the devil took everything from Job, man. Killed his kids, killed his servants, killed his livestock, covered Job in boils and sores. But his wife did not die. That's saying something right there, isn't it? Like, hey, devil, Job's wife's right over there. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Trust me, leave her. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> hey, little girl, don't you get upset? I got some bad news. Better call the vet. Oh, no. As the flames go higher. Oh. The dog's on fire. <laughs> yeah, we gotta look on the bright side now. We'll save a lot of money on puppy chow. Oh, yeah. I'm not a liar. Old people cough when they're done laughing. You ever notice that? When an old person laughs, it slowly turns into a cough before you even know what happened. Like grandpa's having a great time. We need to take him to the hospital. You see him do it like, eh, shoot, Timmy, I do that. <laughs> that is funny. I never know about that. I do that thing. <laughs> that is good. <laughs> My parents used to pray this with me in the dark when I was a kid. Now I lay me down to sleep. I pray the Lord myself to give. If I should die, before I wake, I pray the Lord, my soul. Sweet dreams. <laughs> See you in the morning. Maybe. I don't know. No. I ain't afraid of death. Bring it. Not right now, but you know. <laughs> That's right, man. You're going to want to come to my funeral. <laughs> I'm going to put the fun in funeral. <laughs> it's going to be hard to be sad. I got a big bowl of candy on my chest. That's going to help some people, man. 
People walking by my casket. I can't believe you're gone. I can't believe... Smarties! Oh, my God. I love Smarties. Somebody takes two pieces, I grab their arm. <laughs> Come on. Come to my funeral, man. There's going to be dancing, man. I'm going to have music and a DJ. Mm. Just throw your hands in the air and wave them like it ain't in there. Pick me up. Let me crowd surf. Just... Hey, honey, have you gained some weight in your rear end? The dress you wear reminds me of my old girlfriend And where'd you get those shoes? I think they're pretty lame Would you stop talking cause I'm trying to watch the game If you're a man who wants to live a long and happy life These are the things you don't say to your wife